In today's Chatting with the Stars, I interview Jeff Earnhardt. He's making a name for himself, doing his famous family proud. Check this out. Imagine being the grandson of legendary seven-time NASCAR Cup champion Dale Earnhardt and the nephew of this generation's most popular driver, Dale Jr. Tough tracks to follow, but for Jeffrey Earnhardt, it was destiny. Rising through the racing ranks, he proved his skills and in 2015 made it to the Monster Energy Drink NASCAR Cup Series. But Jeffrey hasn't relied on his famous last name to mark his success. In July, he placed 11th at Daytona and doesn't appear to be slowing down anytime soon. And joining me now is Jeffrey Earnhardt. Jeffrey, you have one of the most famous names in NASCAR, but now you're making a name for yourself. Did you always want to follow in your family's footsteps and be a race car driver? Um, not exactly. I uh, actually had to beg my dad for two years to let me race. <laughs> you just placed 11th out of 40 drivers at Daytona on the very same track where your grandfather, Dale Earnhardt, tragically passed away. What was that like for you to race on that track? It's awesome. Every time you get to go to Daytona, you know, the family history there is huge. Um, you know, my grandpa obviously accomplished a lot there. Uh, what better place to do it than somewhere where your family's uh, established quite a big name. Absolutely, man. And speaking of your grandfather, you just had a big reveal for the car you're going to be driving next weekend. Could you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, so uh, Darlington Race Weekend's coming up, uh, you know, next weekend. So, you know, just so happened the team I joined with, they uh, they run the number 96 car. And I didn't even honestly know that my grandfather drove a car with the number 96 on it. And uh, back in 78, he got the opportunity to go drive this car at Charlotte Motor Speedway for the World 600. It's really cool when you can actually you know, do a throwback and, and, and remember something that your grandfather did. Now, Jeffrey, while our producers were researching you, they noticed that you look like a certain emoji. Have you ever noticed that about your signature smirk right there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that's what everyone tells me. They tell me that's, uh, that's my own personal emoji there. My parents used to hate it. They're like, smile with your teeth, and I, I, just, I just never do. I just smirk. All right, you work with the charity NineLineFoundation.org. What inspired you to get involved with this particular organization? I've always been uh, very supportive of our military. To get to be involved with this has been really life-changing for me to, to get to help out and, and try and bring awareness and, and you know, just do uh, a little part of, uh, of what it takes to show our support to our military. An amazing organization. Jeffrey Earnhardt, thank you so much for joining us on Daily Blast Live, and good luck because we're going to be rooting for you. I appreciate it. Thank you.